talk about his experience with the toxic testing that's going on in this country. Jorge? Here he comes. president because he knew that was the thing to fix if he was going to have a successful presidency. The thing that we need to fix is the testing. It's the testing, stupid. I, uh, uh, about two months ago, I had a chance to go to Washington, D.C. to participate in a dialogue. Uh, a panel of sorts uh, throughout the day and we talked about student uh, accountability and the testing um, and some of the things that we came out from from that we uh, we just wanted I just wanted to share with you a little bit um, is that good testing the overuse of testing toxic tests whatever word whatever title you want to give it that's the one if not most important issue at this moment facing us as educators in a world where public education has become the, politi uh, the politicians bullseye this is what we face merit pay o test right to work less funding more students in each classroom frozen steps frozen base third grade reading guarantee a rush to put into place the common core before we know what the standards are great googly moogly Hold on a second. Then there are the uh, standardized tests. There's a pre-K exam, the OAA, the OGTs. No, the SATs. No, I mean the ACTs. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. The OGTs again. And of course exams. Test, test, test. When will it end? It's the testing, stupid. Let him hear you. It's the testing, stupid. It's the testing, stupid. Make him hear you that way. It's the testing, stupid. As professionals, we're not against tests. Actually, as former NEA president has said many times, Dennis Van Roekel, we're teachers. We invented tests. As professionals, we know that tests don't mean a thing if you ain't got that, uh, in this case, unless you use them to guide instruction and intervention for students. We know what to do with tests. And if, we, and if we're not allowed to use tests for the right reasons, that's wrong. That's right. That's right. As professionals, we know that we have too much testing, which has led to misuse of tests. These toxic tests are used to be punitive to our students, to all of us here, to our, and to our schools. And that's wrong. As professionals, we know that these toxic tests create stakes that are way too high in a school environment that's way too stressful. And that's wrong. It's the testing, stupid, when these insipid little tests do not go beyond the first phase of Bloom's taxonomy. You guys remember that, right? You remember Bloom's taxonomy? It doesn't go beyond the first phase of Bloom's taxon uh, taxonomy of identification and knowledge. It's the testing, stupid, when state legislators... When state legislators... 
debate laws about testing first, then they ask questions later. It's the testing, stupid. When they have turned educators into test giving robots. And sadly, it's the testing, stupid when they have turned our students into test-taking machines. So what do we need? We need a smart implementation of the Common Core, plus a smart testing that'll equal smart students. Let us come together under one idea. Stop the testing, stop it now. Stop the testing, stop it now. Stop the testing, stop it now. Thank you very much.